welcome to another property tour. Today we are at the Taylor Wimpy site at Castlegate. <music> The property we're going to be viewing today is a five bedroom detached property called The Forbes. It is going for £693,000 at the time of viewing. So the property comes with five bedrooms, four bathrooms, and it also has three spaces for cars outside. And the size of the house is 2,370 square foot. It also comes with a garden room and it is also open plan as well. So let's take you inside this house. I'll link all the details about this property in the description box below or I'll put them somewhere in this video. So make sure you guys keep an eye out. Those who may have those burning questions and um, but as you come into the property you are greeted by this beautiful uh, spacious hallway and uh, my favorite feature definitely is this staircase leading up to the bedrooms i just love it another thing i love about it is the skylights and um, again bringing in so much light just imagining the summer very spacious lots of room and um, to the point that we've got a little cabinet here um, that you can just use for decoration. It's so pretty. Uh, guys, I want to know the interior design of this house. Uh, they've done a good job. But yeah, so I'm going to, we're just going to go through the house. Um, so starting with the first room, which is the family TV room. So you can use this as you please. They've currently set it up as family area. So they've got a little couch, little TV in here. Very cozy. You could use this as an office if you wanted to. There is a window bringing in some natural light. High ceilings. And yeah, it's nice. Very spacious. If you've got kids, I would even turn this into like a play area slash a games room. Um, that can do as well for you. But yeah, it's lovely. So we're now going to go into the formal lounge, which is over here to my left. This is a very very beautiful room very cozy again you can see so it's at the back of the property which is nice and um, i love the decor in here as well uh, but yes yeah, very lovely lots of room very spacious i love the windows bringing in so much light it's like a bay window love bay windows i mean don't mention bay windows to didi's because he loves them more than i do <laughs> so yeah we love a good bay window so yeah it's a large room very spacious i'm just allowing you guys to take in this space i'm not talking much oh, i'm not talking much <laughs> just so you guys can take it all in um so this is me in a little corner because i like to demonstrate I'm a, I'm a demonstration babe now i try to demonstrate for you guys how big the space is so this is me in a corner and this is all the space that you get just to give you guys an idea you do have uh, two very large sofas in here you have so much furniture in here uh, but you still have lots of room lots of space uh, very cozy so you have two doors in here so one that can, that leads you into the uh, living space from the main um uh, the entrance of the house you also do have another door here so i'm now going to take you guys into the kitchen slash dining area slash family area so this is a very spacious um property as you can see you've got this beautiful island here with an electric cooker by zanus foot plate gorgeous you've got your extractor fan um, the kitchen is very very large not only do you have um, an island you do also have a breakfast bar uh, personally I think I would opt for either just to preserve space um, for this house but then again 
nothing wrong with having two islands, hey, if you can afford it. But yeah, very spacious kitchen. Love the cabinets. Um, you've got your double oven here. Then you've got a fridge as well, fridge freezer. Um, another thing I like about this island is that you do have cabinets and drawers here. Then you've got um, two bar stools as well. So even though, um, even though I've not shown you guys, you do have a formal um, dining area. Um, but of course, you do have just a day-to-day -day dining area that you can use for normal dinners not formal dinners <laughs> normal dinners um but yeah so this is the other section of the house which is the lounging area again very beautiful very spacious just like the buchanan the forbes gives you that um uh, extra extra room so very big very spacious and remember this house does come with a double garage as well so yeah Plenty of light, lots of windows coming, <laughs> not windows coming in. <laughs> lots of light coming in. You got your French doors here leading you to the back garden. Very spacious garden, as you can see uh, on both sides of the, the property. So just to give you guys a view. So guys, it's a very large garden, very, very spacious. If you've got kids, they can run around out there if you get some sun, especially maybe not on a day like this. Today is miserable. Typical Scottish weather, but we love it. Uh, but yeah, so this is the kitchen. So then you have the utility room. You get a sink in here, and then you also got your boiler. Then you've got the door that leads to your back garden as well. So we are going back out now into the other section of the downstairs, which is your dining room. How gorgeous is this room? Absolutely stunning. The interior designer did a great job i love the colors this is a very quiet room actually guys i'm not gonna lie so if you close the door you don't hear pim from anywhere but yeah very large spacious dining formal dining area you've got here um this beautiful light overlooking the table and uh, this is a eight seater guys eight seater dining table well laid out just imagine during christmas time you've got guests they can get to enjoy in here and then you have your large windows here bringing in so much light so it's a very very beautiful house uh, plenty of room plenty of space i just love it guys um i'm sold if, if again if if somebody wants to buy me this house i'm here i'm ready i'll move in today <laughs> So yeah, so now um, we'll take you guys upstairs. Before we go upstairs, I'm just going to show you guys the downstairs toilet and also a little sort of like a pantry, like changing area. So this is the downstairs toilet. Very spacious. I love the colors. Beautiful. Again, high ceiling. So yeah, so just basic downstairs toilet but with plenty of space and i think my favorite thing about this house is this as well so if you are looking for somewhere to you know let's just put the light on <laughs> so yes i love this space if you're looking for somewhere to put your coats your jackets your shoes etc this is a good a good room and this is not the only storage space that you have downstairs you also do get the under the stairs uh, storage which is over here to my um my right which i'm just going to show you guys quickly so this is the down the stairs storage. There is stuff in there, but you do get an idea of how big it is. So we're now gonna head upstairs. This is a fantastic design of the stairs and giving it that grand feel. So I'm gonna take you guys into the first bedroom, which is the smallest room. Yeah. So the room is currently set up as a nursery. Uh, so this is the smallest room out of the five. 
Uh, even though it's the smallest, it's still big. Uh, you can definitely fit here a double bed. Um, they've set up as a nursery. They've got a cot bed in here and a little changing area. So just to give you an idea of what you can do with the room. So we're now going to go into the second bedroom. So this is the second bedroom. You've got a double bed in here. Very spacious room. I love it. I love the design in here. It's very, very beautiful. I love the colors. Um, again, it's not a very nice day today. It's raining actually, so it's making the room feel a bit dark, but it's still nice. You've got your ensuite here and you've got some storage as well. So this is the ensuite. You've got your toilet, your sink. And then over here, you've got your shower. So we're now going to go into the third bedroom. So back out into the landing, beautiful, gorgeous landing. So this is the master bedroom. Of course, it's going to be the largest of the five bedrooms. Very spacious. You've got your double bed, lots of light coming in, even though, again, the weather is not the best, but still lovely um plenty of space i'll just show you guys again me in the room and how big it looks you've got your also your fitted wardrobes in here as well very gorgeous then we're just gonna go quickly into the ensuite got your toilet your sink and of course your shower So as we come out of the ensuite now, we're going to go show you guys the final two bedrooms um, of the property. So yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying this video. And if you are, make sure you like, comment. It lets us know this is the kind of videos you like to see. And that way we can keep bringing out more for you guys. So I love this room because of the style. Actually, it's very different from the other rooms. So this is the fourth bedroom. Looks like a lot from there, huh? yeah very lovely Um, you don't have any fitted wardrobes in here which is fine because again this is five bedrooms which is big um you can even use this as an office yeah so very lovely you've got you do have a double bed in here so we're now going to go into the fifth final bedroom which is just over here to my right this is the final bedroom again you've got your double bed Got the fitted wardrobes, lots of light coming in, very spacious, <laughs> but very spacious and lovely, uh, lovely rooms. This is the final room. So that was the Forbes by Taylor Wimpy. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like, comment and subscribe. Let us know your favorite feature about this house and hope to see you guys in the next video. See ya.